So we've kind of worked with the ways to work program as an initiative we've placed in excess of 400 people into those roles and these are individuals who've never done engineering and um, haven't got engineering qualifications but because we've introduced Uh, the breach of the law was, uh, was not deliberate, was not intentional, it was inadvertent and that's why it's not a, a, a breach of the, the code. At the same time in relation to Lord Gates, since you're uh, raising it, he's the, um, uh, the independent uh, advisor on the ministerial uh, code and ministerial interests. We've, uh, or no, I should say number 10, have been working with him for months to reinforce, strengthen uh, the role that he's got. And I think it's welcome that that's been concluded because it is an important piece, the transparency and the, uh, the accountability architecture. Uh, Sue Gray's inquiry uh, now addressed. Uh, the conclusion of the Metropolitan Police inquiry, uh, the PM's apologised, the overhaul of number 10 operation has happened. And to be honest with you, um, I do think it's important to turn a page on this. So because what most of uh, our constituents, the public expect from us, your viewers, is getting on with the job of addressing the cost of living.